The Napanee Apple Festival celebrates another year in the heart of the 574, but how has it changed since the festival's start in 1975? My parents had the apple orchard in town, and uh, they wanted to start an apple festival in 1975. And so uh, they came down and talked to my parents. At that time, my parents got involved, but I didn't. I was pretty young. But then a couple years later, they asked me to come on board and help, and that's how I started. I started out by just doing all kinds of projects. I've done just about everything you used to do. We have things like the seven-foot apple pie. That's the world's largest apple pie, and that's probably the most interesting thing to people. And, of course, then we have the normal things like uh, we have really good vendors. We try to have very good quality. Same with our food. We have very good quality food, a lot of local uh, organizations such as Qantas and Rotaries, but we also have outside vendors. And that's what's evolved in 40 years. You know, when I started, we had this little bitty festival. We might have had maybe 10,000 people. And now we have well over 100,000 people attending it and all this stuff going on. I like to see the crowds and, and the great feeling Sunday night when we're done to know that we've pleased 100,000 people plus. I would say the zipper because like you spin constantly and you can like make it move back and forth and everything like that. We keep coming back because we enjoy coming up here and seeing the people and the food and the place where we stay at. We stay at a B&B &B place and we really enjoy that. There's all kinds of stuff you can buy, crafts, antiques and stuff like that. It's cool. I think it's just cool. It's like a family tradition for my family so we go like every year. It's a good one to go to. We don't just cater to one one group of people so yeah, I would say if you haven't been here, come see us. And that's about what I'd like to tell people, you know, so. For Globe News, I'm Katie Spore.